Well, my country is ranking in the tops of the uh, corruption ratings, so it's uh, one of the most corrupt countries in the in the world. Corruption is uh, corruption is affecting all sides of the life in uh, Azerbaijan, and when we look into the problems, we can see that monopolies and hidden interests, uh, conflicts of interest, is the main problem for the most of the problems people suffer from in Azerbaijan. And, uh, and the investigations that we have done have helped to reveal all those connections and the uh, investigating corruption is important to improve the quality of life of people. It helps, uh, it helps to bring more transparency to uh, the uh, to the governance, it, it helps to bring more transparency into the world business, and it brings uh, it helps to prevent uh, to prevent uh, international criminal mechanisms. It, it's really important to invest into training of journalists to uh, and uh, creating those tools uh, for journalists and uh, building the networks of the journalists who are investigating international criminal uh, networks and, uh, and uh, international money laundering uh, schemes. Because uh, the, the crimes are becoming international and the criminals are enjoying, uh, enjoying impunity thanks to the all money they are spending to buy protection, to uh, build the protection schemes. So it's important that the governments and that the international organizations, they invest into more transparency, into more uh, tools for journalists fighting corruption. The problem is that sometimes the governments don't only uh, do their job in uncovering corruption, the governments are involved in corruption. And it's uh, civil society and journalists who are taking the lead in uncovering corruption. And it's important that donors would invest into their work and would do more in, uh, in getting corruption uncovered all over the world. First of all, it's important to spread the knowledge. It's, it's very important. Uh, it's very important to have as many people as possible to, uh, to be involved in investigating corruption. Uh, it's important because uh, when there is only one journalist doing that, it's very easy for the government to silence uh, that journalist by killing, by intimidating, or by simply bribing. So it's important that as many journalists as possible are doing this work, are doing the investigation. And uh, well, that's, that's what uh, Organized Crime and Corruption Reporting Project does. It, it gets more and more people on the board and it gets the knowledge spread. And uh, it's, uh, the databases, the tools that are, they are developing is open for everyone, uh, even, even for citizen journalists. Well, uh, first of all, uh, I hope that investigative journalism and, and actually journalism attracts only clean money. So. Uh, we don't want any dirty money in this business. Uh, so, but, uh, but those who have this clean money should invest uh, in this business because more transparency in the world, uh, more fair play in the world business will help them to develop their businesses. More uh, clean uh, environment for businesses will help the things to get better for the whole world. So don't think about the borders, don't think about the geography. Invest into transparency and invest into investigative journalism. It will help you, first of all.